What are the components of the Linux? Such a question may come up during a job interview. You better be ready. The Linux operating system consists of several key components, including the kernel, shell, applications, and utilities. The kernel is the core of the Linux operating system. It is responsible for managing the system resources and providing low-level services to the other components of the system. The kernel is responsible for tasks such as memory management, process scheduling, device drivers, and system calls. The shell is the user interface for interacting with the Linux system. It provides a command line interface for entering commands and executing them. The shell also allows users to manipulate files and directories, set environment variables, and create scripts to automate tasks. Linux is known for its vast library of applications. These applications are often open source and are available for free. Some popular applications include web browsers, email clients, media players, and productivity tools. Linux provides a rich set of utilities that are used to manage the system. These utilities include tools for managing user accounts, system logs, network configuration, and package management. In addition to these software components, a Linux system also requires hardware components such as a central processing unit, CPU, random access memory, RAM, storage devices, and input-output devices. In summary, the Linux system is composed of several components, including hardware and software, that work together to provide a robust and powerful operating system. The kernel provides the core functionality of the system, while the shell provides a user interface for interacting with the system. Applications and utilities extend the functionality of the system, providing users with a wide range of tools and resources for getting work done. If you persevered to the end, please subscribe my channel so I know that my work is not in vain.